thank you very much. Good morning from my side. Uh, my name is Norbert Neuser. I'm the chief observer of the EU election observation mission. I'm from Germany and I'm a member of the European Parliament since uh, 12 years and working in the Committee of Development and in the Committee of Foreign Affairs. The EU election observation mission was invited by the Gambian Independent Electoral Commission. The EU election observation mission is independent from the European institutions or member states. The election observation mission assesses the election according to the Gambia's national laws and international commitments. In this mission, we undertake its work in accordance with the Declaration of Principles for International Election Observation. The uh, elec Election Observation Mission mandate is to observe and be independent, neutral, impartial, with no interference. The presidential elections scheduled for the 4th of December this year are a significant test for the democratic process in the Gambia. I believe it is crucial for the European Union to observe this election and I trust that the state authorities Political parties and all candidates will play their part in promoting a credible and peaceful election. After several meetings yesterday in uh, Banjul, I hope all sides are committed to conducting the upcoming election according to the Gambian law and regulations as well as international standards. We are observing the whole electoral process, the legal framework, the electoral administration, voter registration, nominations, campaigning, the conduct of the media and also social media, voting and counting, the tabulation of results and electoral dispute resolution. We already met, with, uh, or we are going to meet, the uh, Independent Electoral Commission, the Chief Justice, civil society groups, presidential candidates. I will meet more stakeholders together with my team the upcoming days. Long-term observers will have similar meetings in the regions. 16 of them, eight women, eight men, in teams of two, have been following the electoral process in all eight regions since last weekend. 16 short-term observers and 16 more locally recruited short-term observers will join us around election day. Six members of the European Parliament will also join the observer team. In total, we will have around 70 observers and analysts. What is the election observation mission doing? We observe the pre-election phase. We observe during election day. We stay until after election day until the completion of the election process. Then we will present our initial findings and assessment shortly after the election. And around two months later, we will present the final report, including recommendations on how the process can be improved for future elections. 
We hope that the European Union observation of these elections will assist the Gambia in its stated intention to pursue more democratic process. So uh, this was an overview about our work we are doing and uh, we are going to continue. I will stay until Tuesday and then some days before the election day uh, the other observers are joining us. Um, thank you very much. If you have questions or remarks, uh, please come up. Thank you very much. Uh, as I mentioned, we are observing the whole process, electoral process, uh, the legal framework, electoral administration, the voter registration, the nominations, the campaigning, the conduct of the media and also social media, the voting itself and the accounting at uh, election day, the tabulation of results and the electoral dispute resolution. So we are over many years experience and it's uh, the same fr framework we are using we did in many, many other countries.